welcome everybody back to my channel welcome my new subscribers my returning subscribers and anyone new who may be watching so today we're going to be doing a love letter from your soulmate today so with the first pile we have the zebra jasper stone and this is a green letter we have the amazonite with the yellow letter then we have the dalmatian pink and gray stone with the pink letter here. So whenever you're ready, the timestamps will be in the description box below. Thanks. Welcome everybody who picked pile number one with the zebra jasper stone here and the green letter here. So we're gonna see what a love letter is from your soulmate here. It says, my future wife. I want you to know I have thought about you for a really long time. You make me laugh with your great sense of humor. I want a big family with you. I come from a big family myself. I want to have dogs with you too. I love your intelligence. I am traveling a lot with my job right now. We will, have, we will travel together and maybe live overseas as well. I can't wait till we meet face to face love you lots so with this person i believe that he the moment that he meets you or whatever he is going to definitely feel that you guys are really connected and have a strong connection with one another and he feels that you guys will you guys will have a lot of fun together i feel like he's going to really love your sense of humor He's going to, like I said, he's going to really love your smile. You guys are just going to have so much fun together. I think he's going to be very adventurous too, spontaneous. He's going to be like, hey, you want to go for a wait for the weekend? This is what I think is, is how he's going to act. He's very loving. I feel he could propose to you maybe as well in, uh, in the mountains somewhere. Because he's really like, he likes, he'll really like to surprise you a lot too, I feel. So let's just check here, the cards. So we have solar plexus chakra. So I feel with this person, you guys are both going to really know the moment that you meet them that this is, this is the one for you. There's going to be something very special about him. So it says trapped in fear. This person is going to feel a little, a little intimidated by you, I feel, at first. Because he's going to be... He's... Or he just could be living in fear that he may never meet you as well. Like, But I, I feel you guys will meet, though, on your travels. And he's just frustrated right now because maybe he wants you in his life right now. And he just he just wants this to happen really quickly. So we have rest and rejuvenate. Like I believe this person, like I said, he really likes to be outdoors. Maybe this person even does meditate. Or maybe you guys will do a meditation a lot together. So we have obstacles and challenges. So right now there may be some obstacles standing in the way. Maybe like I said, maybe with him traveling it's kind of hard for you guys to get together right now. And maybe the only communication will be for you guys for a while is to communicate through uh, email or through phone. Then we have solitude. This person, you guys are going to know, you're going to have so much peace in your life with this person. And also I feel this is going to be your next big chapter in your life as well. And you're going to be able to write a beautiful story. And then I have partnerships and alliances. So this is going to be the missing piece to your puzzle in your life here. This is the person that you've been waiting for. And this is the person that's going to make you extremely, extremely happy. And you guys are going to do so many things together in life. 
So now we're just going to pull some Romance Angel cards here. So it says, free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. So with this here, maybe you just feel stuck right now. But like I said, when you meet this person, it's going to be a magical connection. And you're just going to be able to be so free. Be who you want to be around this person. So love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So maybe you have to get to know yourself a little bit better before you end up meeting this person. Maybe that's why you guys haven't quite met yet, because you need to really work on yourself for a bit. And it says, stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. So like I said, this, just keep thinking positive, keep doing your own thing. There is going to be a big change coming once once you meet this person so just be prepared your life will change when you meet this person so we have self-discipline so maybe that's why you need to work on yourself versus just some little bit self-discipline maybe with your finances as well and then we have self-love so yeah, this is just taking care of yourself first as well. And then we have health. So this is to take care of your health too, or maybe like maybe you, you guys will be very fitness people together. Maybe you guys are really like working out. Maybe that'll be the, something that you guys would really enjoy. So the number 41, 61, or 71 might be a significance to you. Maybe you keep seeing that number, or you will see that number when you are close to meeting this person. So we have leg up. This person, I believe, is going to help you whenever you need it. He's going to be there for you. He's going to be uh, so solid for you. He's going to be there whenever you need him, when you call him. He's always going to help you no matter what, I feel. And then we have flexible. So maybe you're going to have to be a little bit flexible in this relationship with him as well. And so, same with him as with him traveling a lot, unless you move to where he is. Then we have fork in the road. Sometimes you guys both wonder where your life is taking you, what direction you're supposed to go in. But right now I think you're meant to be where you're meant to be. It's because you haven't met each other yet. So we're going to just pull some Lover's Oracle cards here. So we have acceptance is the key to inner peace. At times you must accept things as they are. There's no point trying to change that which is beyond our control. So you just have to wait to meet this person. It's not, it's out of your control right now. And we just have to accept it because this is the way it's meant to be right now. gonna see what else we have here in the lover's oracle deck so it says balance love is not always about agreeing just for the sake of it a great relationship is one that both supports and challenges so i said you guys are gonna really challenge each other in this relationship make each other grow as well so you guys are gonna really have a lot of stability growth friendship you guys are going to have it all in this relationship and I feel that you guys will also be very loving and caring towards each other you guys will really protect one another as well so I'm just going to pull some other cards here So we're just going to pull some messages here from them. So 
So it says, I love your smile. I'm proud of you. You're so cute. I love being with you. Let's go on a date tonight. So I think he's going to be really, uh, let's go out, let's have fun. And then it says, I need you. So you guys are both going to really be loving and caring towards one another. You guys are going to do things together. And he just can't wait to meet you, I feel. And then one fell on the floor and it says, I love you. So this person is going to love you beyond what you could have ever imagined. So this is my uh, messages for you today. If you do like my reading, please do like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Welcome everybody. Pick pile number two with the Amazonite stone and with the yellow letter here. So let's see what your love letter from your soulmate says hello my love I am so lucky that when we meet it's going to feel like I won the lottery I am a spiritual person and I know we are connected already at the heart I am super romantic I want to do candlelight dinners for you I want to spoil you with flowers and candies you light up my whole world when you're around me I love you I love you what can I say Till we meet, I love you, sweets. So yeah, this person is very romantic, I feel. And <clears throat> he is super sweet. He will open the doors for you. He will, uh, like I said, he will pull out your chair when you're going to dinner. He will hang up your coat. Like he's just a true gentleman. Very uh, nurturing, caring. Uh, he will be definitely a great dad if you guys end up getting married. But I can see you guys. He will just be courting you and just bringing so much happiness into your life, I feel. And it's just going to be just incredibly uh, attentive and really uh, take great care of you. Even bring you breakfast in bed, I feel. So let's just see what some of the cards say here. So we have Page of Pentacles, we have the Hermit, and we have the Page of Wands. So what I am getting here is this person is thinking about you a lot, or you, or vice versa, or you've been thinking about where this person is. I feel that this person is going to have a lot of stability in his life financially. And he knows he has been very independent on his own already for a really long time. I feel he could have been single for a while now. I think he was focusing a lot on work or he could also own a candy store, I'm guessing as well. Or he, But you guys would go to like old fashioned candy stores together. Like, I don't know, he's really into sweets. Uh, the Page of Wands, I feel that this is going to be some great news coming in for you when you meet this person. I feel things could also happen pretty fast in the relationship as well when you guys do get together. So we have Four of Swords, Two of Cups, And then we have the moon. So there's going to be a lot of emotions when you guys first meet. I think you maybe have taken some time away from relationships as maybe you didn't have great relationships in the past. But I do feel that this is going to be a 
a really deep spiritual relationship here. You guys could also be an interracial relationship, you guys might be. Um, also, like, maybe you're going to be having some mixed emotions at first. If this is the right person for you, but he is going to charm you. And he is going to take such great care of you. And he's just going to, he's going to really court you. He wants to take you out on so many dates. And you're just going to fall in love with this guy. He's just going to like win you over. So we have passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. There's going to be a lot of passion for you guys in this relationship. There's going to be, a, I feel, going to be a lot of chemistry. And he's just going to be so, he could also have longer hair, I feel, as well. A little bit, maybe up to the, the neck length. So we have playful. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit to have fun to shine. So you guys are going to have very a lot of fun together. Like You guys are going to just even be so playful with one another. I feel that this is just, it's going to feel like a, like, you know, you're just going to be like a, like in a, a kid, at like, sorry, like a kid in a candy store. This is just going to bring, bring you so much joy. It's just going to flow so easy between you two as well. But like you said, from the beginning, you may think this is too good to be true because maybe you've had a lot of bad relationships. So it says, make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So just, just make the effort with one another. Like it's just, it's going to work out between you guys. It's going to, there's going to be a lot of love. Like I said, you guys are going to act like maybe like children together. You could also have children in the future together. Two kids. So we have music. So you guys are going to maybe share the same interest in music as well. Then we have healing. So yeah, you guys are going to heal each other a lot. By being playful, having a lot of fun, you guys are going to heal. And then we have effort. So you guys are going to put a lot of effort into this to make it work because you guys want to be with one another. You guys want to make it work. You like spending time together. So like I said, number 13, 66, or 32 may be a significance. Maybe you see that number a lot. So we have breathe. So you guys, you guys just need to relax. He's going to be coming into your life. And I feel with 29, it equals 11. So I feel that you guys could also be like with soulmates or twin flames as well. So we have TikTok. So it's just a matter of time before you guys meet. Like I feel this this could be quite quickly and maybe unexpected as well. Then we have orphaned. I, th I feel that both of you feel very lonely at times, like just thinking if you'll ever meet this person. And sometimes it saddens you because you know you're maybe a little bit older and maybe you haven't met this person yet and you're always wondering, will I ever meet this person? He's coming. You guys are going, both going to heal each other and make each other laugh and enjoy each other's company. So we have power. You instinctively know what is right for you and you have the power to say no or to walk away at any time. Like I said, like if you don't feel that this person is right for you at that time, then you can always have the choice to walk away from this person. But you know what is right for you. If you really feel that this person is right for you, you have the power. So then we have playfulness. Laughter is the best therapy. Have some fun together. And remember, love is the greatest healer. Yes, like I said, love, you guys would be so playful together. 
You guys are going to have so much fun together. I think this is how you might heal each other as well. Because there's going to be a lot of laughing. And just, you guys will maybe even meditate together, I feel, like since he's spiritual. And you guys would just laugh. I see you guys like, have pillow fights and stuff like this. I feel you guys just having so much fun with one another. Like a very beautiful relationship. So I'm going to pull some messages here for you. I love you more than ever. This person is really going to just charm you and just love you. You are one of a kind. Like He's never met anybody like you and you've never met anybody like him. I've been longing for you all day. So when you meet, he's gonna he's always going to want to spend a lot of time with you. I love everything about you. Yeah, this person's going to love you on your bad days, good days. He loves everything about you. And it's, it says thank you. Thank you for being you. Thank you for being so special to him. And it says you're so romantic. So this person, like I said, is going to be a romantic for sure. He's going to do, may even draw you a nice candlelit bath or something like that. He's going to just be so into you. It's going to be so fun, this relationship, so easygoing. And it says, you are my best friend. So you, this is, you guys are going to end up being best friends. You guys just love each other so much and you guys have so much fun together. So this is what I have for you for all the messages today. If you do like my reading, please do like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Welcome everybody. Picked pile number three with this gray and pink Dalmatian stone and this pink uh, letter that we have from love letter from your soulmate. So it says, "Hello, gorgeous. I think you are so beautiful. Your smile, your hair, and the." and the deepness of your soul. You're beautiful inside and out. I want to marry you and see the whole world with you. I hope you love animals. I have two cats. They are my babies. I work in Australia right now. I hope to travel. I hope you, tra I hope you come and travel here. This is how we might meet. I love the wilderness and the beach here. I wish time would speed up as I can't wait till we meet. Hugs and kisses. So yeah, like I get this person might be some type of, he's a really natural person. Maybe he likes to be on the beach quite a bit. Maybe this person likes to surf as well. He likes a natural person, very beautiful. I feel with hardly no makeup, like he just likes natural beauty. And I feel that you guys will have very deep conversations together as well when you guys meet, uh, just even sitting on the beach and talking about things. Maybe you might plan a trip to Australia and maybe meet him there. But he definitely wants to travel with you as well and do a lot of fun things with you. He's very easygoing, nice smile. So we have Fool. So this person really enjoys his freedom a lot. So he really, he's very easygoing, was very independent. You might be the same way. So we have the sun. So like I said, he spends a lot of time on the beach in the sun too. And I feel that you guys would be extremely happy together. He's just going to bring so much happiness out of you. Then we have the page of earth. So, like I said, this person, maybe they could have their own business by the beach in Australia as well. This person is very down to earth. Loves meeting new people. He is financially stable as well. Yeah, so we have the ten of earth. So, yeah, he's, he's making really good money for himself. And he's just, but even though he makes a lot of money, he's very humble. So 
So you have the five of water. So this person, he's going to be very, he's going to have a lot of emotions too. He could also be a Pisces, or Cancer or Scorpio. You could also be dealing with a Virgo sign as well. But he doesn't want to have regrets though about never not meeting you. Because this is very important to him for him to meet his soulmate. He doesn't want to miss this opportunity. So we have love. Like this person is going to have so much love for you. You guys are just, he's going to be like a big lion. Like he's just, he's so lovable. Like I feel like he's quite muscular. Like he really works out. He's quite fit as well. So we're going to see some romance cards here. It says, keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. So maybe this is someone that you maybe you never think you'd fall in love with. But you, he was, he's going to surprise you with his charm. So we have past life relationship. You have known each other before. So this is going to be this deep connection where you maybe think you've known each other before, but then it's going to be kind of like, have I known you before? But you're just going to click. It just feel you're going to you could be able to sit and talk for hours with one another. So it says here, stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. So just keep thinking positive. You are going to meet this person. You, are, you guys are not going to miss each other. He doesn't want to have these regrets. So he's going to keep his eye out for you and see what's going to happen between you two here. So we have manifestation. So I believe that maybe some of you guys all, all have been manifesting this guy and maybe he's been manifesting you as well because I feel that there's a lot of love a lot of feelings here. We have a lot of pink. So your favorite color could be pink as well. So we have number 19, pride. So he takes a lot of pride in himself and what he does for a living, how he communicates with people. He's very proud of himself. So we have 57, teaching and learning. So you're going to learn a lot from this person. You're both going to teach each other a lot. So maybe he's going to teach you to surf, or you're going to teach him some stuff that you know. You guys are just going to teach each other a lot. It's just going to be very, very easygoing. A lot of learning, a lot of, he's going to be very open-minded. You can talk to him about absolutely everything. So we have here and now. So he just wants you to think about what's happening now, even though he wants to meet you. He wants you to just focus on the here and now because this is all what we have right now. But he, you, are, you guys are going to meet. I feel like you guys could meet in, in August or something sometime. So we have the fates. So you guys are destined to meet, definitely. This is something that is, is lined up in the stars for you guys to meet. So you guys will connect one way or another. So we have 44. So you guys have been thinking a lot about each other. And maybe, like I said, manifesting one another. Like this is something that you guys both been wanting. Maybe even manifesting for a specific person. And maybe he has. And maybe you guys will actually meet somewhere. While traveling, you could some people could meet in Australia, some people might meet somewhere else. So we have let there be closeness between you, but always give each other space. Love never claims, it simply allows and gives. Like, like I feel that this per you guys are going to give each other some space, do your own thing. I don't believe that you always have to be together day and night. You guys both like your own adventure and your own freedom. And, but you guys are going to be, like I said, the closeness between you two is going to be like very, very good. So let's 
let's check another one here. So we have secret admirer. Someone has deeper feelings for you than they are letting on. So maybe this person already knows who you are. Maybe you guys are uh, on social media. Maybe he knows who you are and maybe he knows that you want to travel and stuff. Or maybe you guys have met and you're going to go see him. So just always see, so like keep an open mind here of who this person may be. I'm going to pull some messages here for you. So it says, I'm crazy about you. You make each day an adventure. Your smile makes my day brighter. Yes, this person absolutely thinks you're beautiful. He's, you guys are, he's gonna be nuts about you. You're my everything, yes. So you guys, you guys are gonna be each other's everything. You guys are gonna be best friends. Um, let's go away for a weekend, romantic weekend. So he's gonna be like very loving, romantic, you guys could have even a romantic picnic on the beach. Together we can do anything. And it says, I love spending time with you. So yeah, this person is going to really like enjoy spending time with you. There can never be enough time in a day for him to be with you. So this is all the messages that I have for you today. If you do like my reading, please do like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.